Hey guys, we have a vlog. We have a brand new vlog. A lot has been going on. I wasn't in the best mental space. I was really anxious about something. I ended up turning out well. Update guys, I am currently working in the emergency department. I'm going to be working in the emergency room for, the, for over one month. It has been a lot, to be honest. Like, I feel like that is it's way more stressful than um the opd there's a lot of adrenaline rush a lot of energy which i like about it i have been on night shift since friday today is sunday and this night is going to be my last night and then i'm going to be off for the next three days so that's good i'm really looking forward to that let's go back from outside i got flowers guys i got flowers let me show you guys properly yeah, I got flowers. They're really cute. Also very, very colorful, which I really, really like. <laughs> but guys, see. Look at. Like I said, I, um, I'm going to work this evening. So I just want to rest, okay? I just want to prioritize rest and relaxation. I just had breakfast. Guys, the breakfast I had was just... I just looked into my fridge and tried to whip something up. Like literally, when they say somebody tried to whip something up, that's what I do. Whenever I buy sweet, I buy a lot actually. So I keep most of it in the fridge just to have as a snack every now and then. So I had I I I, I had some suya with some boiled corn and coconuts, guys. That's what I had for breakfast this morning. I'm going to keep this here because it has um water in it so it's going to still last for a bit actually maybe till like tomorrow morning or this evening if i remove it from the um paper or this wrap and then put it in the bars <clears throat> pretty much hi guys it is currently for what's the time actually 4 38 and um i'm almost ready for work uh, well, after the last time you saw me, I cleaned my house and um, I just really went to sleep, guys. I just really went to sleep, woke up, and today is the first day I am missing um, an upload because I upload twice weekly. Today is the first day I'm missing an upload in like six weeks, guys, to be honest and i just couldn't okay i just couldn't i needed to sleep um and it's because i've been working in the ear the ear is just something else guys something else <laughs> i'm going to go to work and see what the day brings is the uncertainty for me guys you go to work you don't even know you have zero idea right what <laughs> the call is going to be like if it's going to be busy crazy just like completely chill zero idea <laughs> well i really do hope it is chill i want a chill day guys i really want a chill day i feel like with um the outpatient department with the clinics you can still guess right because people who come to the outpatient um clinic it's not an emergency right so there are specific days like on public holidays you see more people coming to the clinics because they just have more time they don't have to go to work all of that they are less busy so it makes sense like they'll just be like oh let's just go to the hospital let me refill my meds or oh, i have this little cough because they have time on their because they have time on their hands they would like oh let me just go to the hospital um as opposed to if it was a weekday and they were working you know you would see less people then but with like the emergency room there's nothing to go with there's nothing to go by really like zero you have nothing you have nothing to go on you just emergencies come nobody can time emergencies emergencies are not um determined by people it comes at literally any time my first day on friday <laughs> The ER was crazy guys, crazy. We had someone almost delivered. We had like an acute kidney injury. 
um, heart failure condition we just had a lot um, open wounds that had to suture actually every day I, I suture wounds <laughs> that's the truth like every day someone comes in bleeding I have to suture so so yeah um if you're a medical student or like a house officer please learn to suture while you are still in training because nobody's going to actually force you to learn all these things you have to be willing to learn it and you have to like apply yourself if not you're not going to be forced especially if you're working in like a teaching hospital or something where there's a lot of competition with like registrars and whatnot to learn nobody is going to start um, policing you to come and learn stuff okay and the moment you finish house job guys i kid you not nobody nobody's going to be asking you if you know you know if you know how to suture or not they just expect you to and i feel like nobody talks about that like nobody talks about the fact that like um once you are done with house job and you actually start your practice proper you just everybody thinks you know everything so that's why the time that you're working under like complete supervision which is doing medical school and doing house job you have to apply yourself and learn all these things like it seems like oh it's just passive but you are going to make use of it and you don't want to look stupid in front of you know other healthcare professionals and patients okay you don't want to look stupid in front of the nurses the patients when you are the only doctor in the ER and a wound a an open wound comes and you don't know how to suture do you understand what i mean so yeah um learn as much as you can be a sponge soak up i know it is very very um stressful to um doing house job right it's like so many things are trying are fighting for your attention so it's very stressful but you need to prioritize learning okay that's the only thing you have for yourself all those chase blood chase results chase you know all those things it doesn't like it doesn't add anything to your skill okay the only things that add to your skill and that help you be a better doctor are the hands-on things and actual management of the patient so you need to be proactive with that in learning nobody's going to teach you i can't stress that enough i need to go guys it is 4 6 4 46 and i need to be at work by 5 so yeah let us um get to work and save lives okay Hey guys, I just got to work and I just offloaded my bag for everything I'm going to need for the night. I have a charger here. I need to plug this watch because it's literally dead. Then my water is right there and everything I'll pretty much need. But I'll arrange it very soon. Um, it seems like a busy night and I also have other things to do. So I'll speak to you guys maybe later or when I get home. Okay? Okay. Bye. Just don't understand. <laughs> morning today is wednesday i haven't vlogged in a few days actually like it's been a while since i vlogged um on here because i have been i've been feeling really burnt out and um i know that you people talk about me like being really consistent right but like i feel like the way i get to manage that is really really knowing myself and knowing when i feel like i need to chill right like i would not be posting on youtube at the expense of my mental health pretty much so whenever i feel like i am feeling like really burnt out i like to take a break also because youtube is not my, my primary job i'm a doctor and i have other things also that i'm you know working towards and doing so yeah i am very okay with youtube taking the back seats whenever i feel like i'm not 100 yeah i'm on a phone call and the person that i'm on a phone call with is also calling somebody and they are muted right now so they can't hear me well, I hope that you can't hear because like 
yeah the person is just like right here anyway yeah um i just wanted to do this intro and just continue this vlog today is wednesday i have been off work for the past three days okay monday tuesday wednesday i was off work and guys i spent the whole of monday and tuesday on my bed and now it's wednesday and it's 12 p.m and i'm just realizing i'm going to work tomorrow and i need to like get things done and just like set myself up for a good um work week or work time or work days or whatever because i'm working for the next six days before i have my next off time i lost my atm card as well so i want to go to the bank and retrieve that and yeah just get a bunch of things done guys see my flowers they're really really thriving can you see them some of them are falling off though like i needed to like remove a bunch i needed to remove a bunch of them so some of them have fallen off but yeah hi what happened hey guys so i am currently cooking my elder brother is in lagos and he's coming so i just wanted to like make something for him to eat that's the only reason why i'm cooking now guys so i'm making some rice there's there's like two eggs inside that place and then some stew the quick stew i i had like blended pepper in the freezer and um, yeah so it has some smoked catfish and i have put some shaki in here these are shaki I don't know if you guys can see so i'm going to let it boil down before i then put my um meats and pomo inside so yeah this is what uh, my brother is going to eat when he gets here um my kitchen is also kitchen is also a mess i'm watching youtube right there but like i'm trying to wash different things i cleaned out my freezer or my fridge and you know i had a lot of half empty containers that i and some spot food actually that i needed to like just arrange so that's why we have this and yeah the top of my microwave is also a mess but we're going to sort that out really quickly and um yeah i'll see you guys later my day is already not going particularly as planned um majorly because of my brother coming and i don't like people coming to my house and not eating actually except like i'm like really overwhelmed like i have something like overwhelming i don't like coming to my house and not having something to eat so especially my brother like this is my brother calling must probably here already hold on hello yeah what's up okay hold on it's here guys my brother is here here so i'll talk to you guys later i'm sure he does want to be on camera Hey guys um it's been a few hours after the last time you saw me my brother came so like naturally we were just gisting and whatnot he's still around actually he hasn't left he's going to go to his hotel soon but he has eaten he finished the whole food <laughs> he has eaten and then i'll take some for him to go as well but he's in the living room taking his call a work call or something so yeah i just want to shower i want to have my bath also i went to the bank i think i made like a short clip about that i want to go i want to shower have my bath and go out because the cooking i did earlier is not the main cooking i wanted to do actually that was just like impromptu cooking with what i had in my fridge i, I realized i had some pepper and some meats in my fridge so i just quickly made that food but now i don't really have much in my fridge i still have some fried rice but i think that's about and some meat actually but i want to make you know some some meals or some foods for some food for the for the next six days so that when i'm working i don't have to really cook anything really big or go to the market so yeah like denim but it's not denim it's just like normal cutting material that has this denim look so this is just what i'm wearing very simple um to run my errand hey guys editing busola here um this is like one and a half months into the future um i was just editing this video and 
it had to end abruptly this way because i just randomly stopped vlogging and the follow-up the next vlog that i started or the next clip is supposed to be a full vlog okay so it's an exciting one and that one will be released on sunday so i just wanted to get this one out of the way i know it was quite short and a bit boring i apologize for that but thank you guys so much for always sticking with me i really really appreciate you guys um please like share subscribe and look forward to um sunday's vlog okay it's a fun one i went for an event i was invited for an event and it was something i was really excited about and many more things actually so yeah um that will come on sunday like i already said thank you guys for always sticking by me and for always watching don't forget to be kind to yourself and be kind to others i will see you in my next vlog okay bye